Hey everybody, what's up? J4T... J4T-Foy here. Uh, more Shadow of Colossus. From the Eco and Colossus Shadows Collection. PlayStation 3. While we're at it, go ahead and leave a like and a subscribe. And, uh, leave some comments too. Everything is always appreciated. More the better. It's always awesome. Like, even the littlest bit, if, like, I'm having a bad day and I can't get myself out of bed because I'm so depressed, but then I see a comment, and it's like, yes, I can get out of bed today because that just uplifts my mood even just a little bit. Or even a new subscriber or five. Oh, you know, like I said, more the better, though. And um, if you are interested in this game for free, I will... Um, uh, let you know how that is possible at some point yeah. later on yeah. Yeah. in my playthrough. Which we're gonna be coming up to the yeah. end very, very soon here, actually. After this is gonna be the third to last session because we are going to do Colossus 12, 13, yeah. and 14 in this session, which they should I'm hoping it doesn't take more too much more than an hour. And then after that, I'm going to do 15 in its own session and then 16 in its own session because they are, they can be kind of lengthier. So I'd rather just have the most tedious shit, you know. I, I can at least take a break uh, yeah. in that time. Um, yeah. So yeah, look forward to, stay tuned, tune in, find yeah. out how you can find more information should you be interested in getting this game as a giveaway. And even if you already have it or you already played it, you know, maybe you want to gift it to yeah. somebody else. Just don't, you know, tell me that because I'd rather yeah. it be yours. But, you know, you could get it as a gift and then give it to somebody else or something. Yeah. I don't know. Um, but then again, hey, there's always yeah. a lot of giveaways on my channel should you happen to miss this one anyway. Yeah. So, like I said, stay tuned. Um, I'm going to try to pick up where I left off when talking about, like, yeah. um the depths or the details of origins of my channel and there is a s oh shit oh wow 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 i almost thought i was gonna fuck that up wow that was close i'm glad i didn't have to fall off and redo it so um let me see i picked up on talking about 2011 because we talked about the end of 2010 which i finished school and had some shitty temporary job so in the beginning of 2011 about february to march um i had a job and it was a nice job i just sucked so it was it was a it was a ma it was something between that it wasn't really a good culture fit either um, I got, I mean, I got along with people, however, you know, it just became pretty immediate that I probably wasn't even in there because, like, I, I wasn't really having fun, actually. So, um, that happens. Let me see. Um, so, like, I should have realized it back then at that time, but I didn't. But I really didn't care about computer stuff by then. I I spent so much fucking time looking for a job like it was a job itself that I had no time to get better at my craft, to learn, to improve my technical skills and what have you. You know, if I was spent t any time learning, I was learning how to look for jobs better, more efficiently, how to be a better, how to do interviews better present myself um i think i got my pitch ironed down pretty well at that time mo for most of the time it wasn't perfect but you know i had i think i had it down for the most part um and what else you know so i'd spent so much fucking time learning just to be better at looking for work like if i'm not look if i'm not if i'm not actually learning well okay it's one of those things where it's much easier to learn when you're actually putting it to use right 
Otherwise, like, I can read it, but I don't absorb it. Um, and I noticed that I had a lot of difficulty with that. Here goes our introduction to our Colossus. Um, and he shouldn't be too difficult, I would hope. Um, so yeah, it's like, how wide of a spectrum it is for information technology. It's like, okay, I can try to study and get good at something. However, um... It really doesn't matter how much I try to learn this shit because, you know, I don't, I'm not, I'm not absorbing it. I'm not putting it to use and when you don't put it, to, you know, when you don't use it, you lose it, right? So, it didn't really matter what I would have tried to, oh shit, yeah. I need to be under the water otherwise you can't fuck with me. So... Um, you know, it wouldn't have mattered what I would try to learn at that time because I just would have not absorbed it at all. And it really fucked me up too because I needed, uh, you know, I needed to get certifications and everything, right? So the thing with that was, you know, because I was always going from one temp job to another, one contract job to another, um, by the time when I, I would actually save up something to feel comfortable enough to, um you know, splurge a little bit or whatever that obviously it, it's because it's like a hundred hundred bucks for the test and you know without steady income I'm not really going to go out of my way to spend a hundred bucks just to do a test for something I might not even, you know uh pass, because it's just like a voucher you don't need, it's like just to do the fucking test so at least that's from what I recall I think it's like a hundred bucks every time, and if I if I, it's a way it's gonna be a waste a hundred bucks if I don't pass it right. So, um, you know, every time I would I would have enough saved that I'd be able to, um, splurge just a little bit. Oh, I wanted you to go over to that, but that's that's what's annoying about this guy sometimes. Is that he does not always... Can we make it? Oh! I almost thought I was going to fall. And I don't like to fall. Okay, so... Like, uh, every time I would, I would save up enough, I'd be back out of a job again. So, you know, a hundred bucks and I don't have a job, then... Um... It's, it's better just to save it up or, you know... Because I'd just be on the road all the time looking for a fucking job. So pretty much like all my money would go towards a job. Uh, 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 uh. I was hoping I was going to be able to get him with that one. Just like one more, one or two more stabs and we should have this guy. So, okay, and then he's going to break that. I was like, what the fuck? Because he was like all squishing me in there in his armpit thingy. So, by the time I would uh, save up enough, I'd be out of a job. And by the time I'd have another job... I'd be out of money, so... Or I'd be out of savings, or, or I'd be running on E, pretty much, right? So, that was a dilemma, of course. And, uh... Let me see. So, that would happen. And so, when I had this job, there, you know, I was making 16 bucks an hour. You know, I'd spend some of the free time just trying to study for a, a certification test or something. You're like, oh, don't worry about that. Those are useless. It's all about experience these days. So then, you know, I'd go from using my free time to studying for a certification or something to just reading news. Um, and I wouldn't even be reading technical news. I'd just be reading regular-ass news because it really didn't seem to matter what I would read because, like, I wasn't really... It, your first month or three, usually it's... I, I, Maybe I'm slow. I assume that it just that amount of time it takes you takes a, a person to learn, you know, enough about the job, the role, the, the company, environment, you know, all those nuances, just to become uh, efficiently automated enough to, you know, become automated. So I could be able to do whatever I have to do in my job just to become efficient and productive and, and you know, all that regular bullshit job. St okay, he had destroyed... Okay, they're over there. 
just to become efficient enough that I could be a decent, moderately decent at least, um, worker. So, you know, the first month, you know, I was, I was finally starting to learn my way around. I still didn't know everything. Shit. It took me, like, most of that month just to learn my way around the facility. Because it was kind of a larger facility. It was like a warehouse, and, like, half of it was a warehouse, half of it was an office, because it was, like, you know, a, a, a meat place, whatever. So, uh, you know, it, t it took me that much, it took, it took me probably, a l oh shit, it took me a little bit too longer than probably preferred to learn my way around. And, uh, you know, the whole time there we were also sharing the same fucking office, and that gives very little amount of time to have breathing room, have space, well, wow, he's done. We defeated that Colossi. So that's 12 Colossi down. And... Four more to go? No. Yeah, four more to go. Cool. So... It took me all that time just to learn my way around the, the place and start to get... Start to get kind of automated enough. Start to learn, you know... The, the software and the computer, how, how we had the computer set up, all that stuff, so I'll continue in a moment.